My name is James Cash. I live here in Anchorage, Alaska. I've been here since 2005. One of the reasons why I just love Alaska and Anchorage, it's just a better quality of life here. I mean, that's why people come here. There's less people, less traffic, more opportunity. The wages are higher. You get more land when you purchase a home. I actually live in Palmer, which is about 45 minutes away. And I grew up in Nome, Alaska. So I'm used to hunting, camping, hiking, fishing, biking, just, you know, being in the outdoors. And it's the opportunity for people to live a life that's symbiotic with the relationship of nature. Uh, I started at KW back in the day. This was in uh, 2013, so I've been licensed for about a decade. And uh, after three months on a team, decided to go solo. If I wanted to make calls, the question was, who am I calling? So I needed leads. I just did what any human would do. I went to Google, I typed in real estate CRMs. Real Geeks was one of the top five. I searched the top five companies. I asked other agents I knew who was using the different platforms. And ultimately, at first, I decided on Real Geeks because truthfully, I was just broke and it was the cheapest. And I've, I've been with them ever since. Um, so right now, I have just shy of about 20,000 people in my database. Uh, I've been, as an agent and a team owner, I've been a party to uh, over a thousand transactions or sites closed since I've started in 2013. And if I had to guess, I could probably pull stats, but if I had to guess, I'd say three to 500 of those closings or leads are probably from Real Geeks CRM. Real Geeks has a ton of features in there, everything from workflows. We also use texting. Uh, we do email blasting and campaigns. Real Geeks does have a really good database of email campaigns that are already built in that you can just plug and play. We also use the uh, video feature as well. Now, beyond that, some of the things we do from your just typical CRM login notes and follow-ups appointments, are they in escrow? Are they in repair negotiations? You can tag all those things. But what I love about Real Geeks is like, yeah, it, it is the foundation of our business. It's where we go to find new leads. It's where we go to cultivate and curate relationships that are either new and just starting out, or we've closed them, you know, a decade ago, uh, where we send postcards to client, where we wish them a happy birthday, where we literally follow up with anyone we've ever met and log detailed notes on our relationship about them. And what I can tell you, I think the most important thing in life and also the most important thing in real estate is your relationship with someone. And it allows you to seamlessly log and cultivate and curate that relationship in perpetuity. And it helps you expand your business just as much as you want to. Since 2014, I've had Zillow. I've paid hundreds of thousands of my money to Zillow and Zillow Leads. And uh, what I found, especially this year, is that Zillow was just underperforming. It was negative ROI for me this year, so much to the point where I thought my agents weren't handling those leads. So I hopped on Zillow for 45 days and I closed a big fat goose egg. The only thing I got out from spending $5,000 on me and Zillow is a pre-qualified buyer for a $100,000 condo that does not exist in this market. So I dropped Zillow, they suck. And I said, what I don't wanna do is just pocket that money. I wanna redistribute it back into the company. So I was not doing seller leads at this time. I decided to spend $600 a month starting this month on seller leads from Real Geeks and we already signed three listings and when they close, because they will close in this market, it's gonna be north of 30 grand GCI. And if you wanna ask about the quality leads, like they're freaking baller leads, they're gonna be better than going to an open house. The majority of the numbers we're reaching out to, at least over 50% are real people from my state. Now, the thing that I look at specifically for lead capture is thus, what is my cost per click? How much am I paying to drive traffic to the website to get an actual name and number of a person that I can call that can make a real decision about real estate today? And what I have found is that Real Geeks is the solution to that problem. Real Geeks has been for real estate the best pay per click manager that I've experienced in real estate, hands down. And I've fired three different other companies prior to Real Geeks launching their PPC campaign to manage those. Not only do I have people to call, like I have legitimate leads. Like I can show you a text on my phone right now that I made two calls to this person. They answered the second time. We talked about it. I was on a trip out of town yesterday. They texted me during a conference and they said, hey James, they sent me a link from the Real Geeks website and said, I wanna put an offer in on this home. And that was a $750,000 home. So I probably spent realistically $5 on the lead 
uh, 10 minutes of my time making two calls and now I'm gonna make like a $20,000 commission. So like that is how powerful the Real Geeks website and platform can be. But the truth is you have to be a good steward of those leads. If you're in real estate, you wanna do big business or small business or anywhere in between, yeah, I think Real Geeks is a place to go.